I love rule number one because it says, it takes skills to make the last shot. It takes confidence to take it. Some people don't know how to respond in a situation and it's basically encouraging them to do it, take the last shot. It inspired me because like, it was telling how to solve different situations in life and it was based on basketball and I will definitely use these rules in school. Well, I like that the book then told me different ways and told me the rules how to go through life. People in the book inspired me how to go through life and how to deal with the bullying and things that I might go through. Um, in the playbook, it inspired me because one of the quotes I seen, it said like, don't let the past like control what you do next. And it helped me because I was going through a lot through basketball and I didn't know because I was doing like, I wasn't as good as in there. So I thought I wasn't going to be able to keep going. And like as I read the book, I was still playing basketball and it helped me a lot and inspired me to keep moving and keep going. And I didn't stop. Teammates are like family, celebrating wins, consulting loss, a net tied together. The playbook inspired me to do one thing and to be dedicated to it. The story talks about a girl who had disability problems and couldn't use her legs, but the girl wanted to run, so the girl started and became the fastest woman. All she had to do was keep trying and trying her best. The Playbook is a very good book and I will recommend it to anyone. The Playbook kind of inspired me to keep the right mindset and work ethic, even in the most challenging of times. So like, if you're passionate about something, like whether it be a sport or an art or getting into a college, you have to be prepared to like take charge and face the challenge. Um, it inspired me to work hard in everything I do and focus like less on the mistakes I've made in the past and more on the changes I can make in the future. We love for you to come visit us and we can tell you more. At Franklin Middle School. And we would hope that you come because we want to tell you a lot and that we love your book. Thank, Thank you, Kwame.